A 25-year-old man remains in hospital tonight with severe burns after escaping a house fire in Perth's southeast. Two other men and a 12-year-old boy were asleep inside when the fire broke out. It was their home for just three weeks. Now they're looking at a blackened mess. That's what's left of DJ's room. Trying to make it our house and we've just lost stuff that we're never ever going to get back. You know, my son's just pretty much destroyed. 12-year-old Dylan Pinker was woken by loud bangs and screaming. His room was right next door to where the fire started. That's your room there? Yeah, it was. It was... Yeah, it's just gone now. Absolutely nothing there anymore. Now it's just all gone. Not a single thing could have been saved. 25-year-old Andrew Murray was getting ready for work just after 5 o'clock this morning. The cause of the blaze, a suspected faulty power board in his bedroom. This room was just literally gutted. It was flames to the roof. We couldn't do anything but stand back and watch it go. Within about five minutes it was just gone. There's not much you can do about it. Yeah. Housemate Stephen Laycock tried to hose down the flames and move a burning mattress out of one of the rooms. But as I've grabbed it, the flames have raced up my arm and I just quickly let go of it as quick as possible. Andrew was trying to gather some belongings as the fire quickly took hold. He suffered third degree burns to his left hand and minor burns to his face. At least we're all safe and that's the main thing. That's, uh, we, can, we can move on. Tracy Vaux, Nine News.